Welcome to Dragon Horde Gaming, and in today's video, I'll be opening up not just one, but two The Brothers War Gift Bundle Edition, or Bundle Gift Edition, whatever you want to call it. The gift box. Alright. These are, feel a lot heavier than what I'm used to. Oh, look at that. Pretty cool. Is it on the other side? Urza. We got Transformers and Urza. Okay. That's kind of weird. Oh well. Open the box up. And then we got ourselves a little punch out Transformer card there. Oh, and Megatron and Starscream on the other side. Okay. All right, we got our land pack and all that. We got our eight set boosters, our one collector booster, and our unique to this transformer spin down D20. All right, so. We'll start off with the. Uh, oh, oh, I meant the dice. We'll start off with set boosters. And I'll open up the other one here and get its goodies out too. Got 16 of those. All right. Now we're all ready to start opening. All right. The reason why I got two of them was I uh, traded a Warhammer um, kit, not not the commander deck, but an actual Warhammer model kit that I had purchased years ago that they don't make it quite like that anymore and traded it for one of these gift editions and some cash. I need the purchase. Oh, I'm not going to open those yet. I'm going to save those for later. All right. right off the bat, we get a sign card, a full art swamp, Get through our commons. Some uncommons. And it looks like we already have a full art card here. And it's Teferi. The Planeswalker I did not have. And I was I was real bummed today. I went to the store. I was waiting for someone to show up. They said they were going to trade me one. They never showed up. Well, I don't need it anymore. So we got Teferi. Cool. Liquid metal coating. And for that. And Urza Prince of Krug for our rare. And Carrion Lotus foil. And a soldier token. Alright. You know I'm moving these over here. It'd probably be easier for me to help you open them then. Just grab a pack without having to bump the camera. No list card in this one, just some tokens. Kyle's Command. Basic Forest. Frexian Revoker. That's a rare. But then a separate pile. And Lauren of the Third Path for a rare. And a foil of Raised to the Ground. Put the foils up here. Let's put the Mythics in a separate pile. Now that I've moved the card packs out of the way, I can put Mythics in one and all that. All right. We've got an Ashnod art card, Foil Planes, and 
Only four commons. Hurrah, hurrah, or Harjar, a loyal bodyguard, a gurgling anointer. Didn't wait, didn't we get? No, that was a carrying locust and a power stone token. All right, we got planes, art card, island, and. Go. Self assembler. One with the multiverse. That's a second mythic. Pretty cool. And a winged commando for our foil. Powerstone token. Oh, moving those over here. Under all the stack so I can get to them later. A defense grid schematic. And a geologist enthusiast. Okay. Ivory tower. Ooh, and a Mishra claimed by Gix. Awesome. I did not know you could get foils in that slot of the Transformers. And the other side of Mishra lost to Phyrexia. Alright, and we got Blitzwing Crew Tormentor and Adaptive Assailant on the other side. I'll put that over there. And we got our first list card. Okay. That's a good card for a uh, Lands Matter deck. I don't know if it's actually worth anything. We got a schematic key to the city art card. Let's get our commons out of the way. Goblin Char Belcher. Brain Stone, and a Foil Survivor of Corliss. And we're just one after another for the schematic cards. This is a... I can't think of the name of it. It's a legendary artifact that makes a copy of a creature. It has haste. We got Mountain. And it's not legendary if the equipped creature is legendary. Um, yeah, it's all going all the mess here. Elsewhere flask. Ooh, a mox amber. That's a good one right there. Oh, that is so good. Another Mishra. And a corrupt foil. An Elspeth Undaunted Hero from uh, Escape from Not Escape Ugh. Theros Beyond Death. Meh. I don't think it's worth very much. Oh, and that's not the main one either. That's the one from the Planeswalker deck, too. Okay. Mm, no schematic that time. Oop. Sorry. I want to see the art. Uh, Power Stone Engineer. Yay, I got it right. Although the, the art on the card kind of gave that away. I got a, some Swift Foot Boots. Tuscasse. Dig Sight Mentor for a rare and an Ashnod's Harvester. Oh, there was that card I was talking about earlier. Why would it be in the list and also... That doesn't make sense. Well, 
We got Helm of the Host. That is a good one. I thought it was a Mythic, too. I guess it's only Mythic in the... Those... One, oh, back to the schematics again. The planes. Oh, I think I saw something good there. Oops. Pristine Talisman. Tyrant of Courage. Nope, it wasn't that good. Spectrum Sentinel. Okay. And a Power Stone token. Well, that was the first pack of the second box, so... Well, we got another Helm of the Host. Schematic art. Mountain full art. Look through these commons. Uncommons. Rescue Retriever. Chromatic Star, oh, Fortified Beachhead, and a Foil Mishra's Domination, and a Teferi Spirit Token. Okay. Yeah, I think really now all I need to get is a uh, Urza Lord Protector. That'd be great to pull. Uh, I got a Char Belcher signed. Island. Bunch of commons. Commons. Mishra's Bobble. That's a couple bucks there. Death Bloom Ritualist. And a Foil Self Assembler. And a Crumbling Colossus. Okay. Another schematic. This is the. Uh, something engineer. I can't think of it at the moment. It is Foundry Inspector. I'm bad at that. Actually, no, I have it in like three decks. Right. Um, we got a rare here. Well of Lost Dreams. And a schematic pristine talisman. Oh. One half of Urza, the Might Stone and Weak Stone, and a Stern Lesson Foil. All right. Okay. So we got a foil full art land there. We got, uh, don't know what that one is. Gina Eyes of Gaia. Gaia. Right. Foil Forest, the Commons. Commons and a millstone. Simeon Selacum for a rare and a foil Gaia's Courser. And that. Um, only three mythics, really, so far. This one hasn't had any mythics, has it? They're all in the last box. Okay. The, whatever that was. I'm not going to guess anymore. There we go. Acker Wellspring. Liquid Metal Coating Schematic. Automatous Assembler. So good for that assembly worker tribal. Mightstone Animation. And a Thopter Token. Two packs left, and then it's into the collector packs. Oh, what, pack? what is going on with these packs? Right. Uh, that's one of those artifact creatures. And full art planes. Go through our commons. A lot of commons this time. Semblance Anvil. That's a good one. Oh, there's another mythic in the trenches. I pull this mythic a lot. Scrap work mutt for foil. This 
Bump Art, Island, Commons, Uncommons, a Blaster Combat DJ. That's our second Transformer. Sigil of Valor. Another Death Bloom Ritualist. And a Scatter Ray and a Placeholder. Alright. Well, let's go over and see what we got here instead of getting into those. Alright. We got the Calvin Krug. And it's a Cyclonus the Saboteur. It's kind of faded, too. Alright. Then we got our Foil Lands. Doesn't look like we have any miscuts or misprints along these, which would have been amazing. Those are worth quite a bit. Alright. Let's get this card out of the way because we don't want it. We got a foil Ultra Magnus Tactician. Alright. I did forget to show the, the back of the Cyclonus. There we go. All of which I already have. So looking through these, there are just foil lands. There does not appear to be any problems with them. Still does not want to blast them through all these lands. I'll donate these lands to my local LGS where I bought these. The next level. Oop, wait, wait. No, I thought that said something different other than Island on there. I'm like, oh, that would have been something. Okay. And on to the collector's packs. Well, that's the first time I've seen the zombie token. Okay, we got we got a Hercule Blast Zone. That's the first time I've gotten the Blast Zone. That's an extended art. Kyla's Music Box, Hiker Wellspring, Swiftfoot Boot Schematic, Symbolic Sandville, Optimus Prime Hero. Staff of Titania Foil Extended Art. Okay. And a Foil Power Stone Zombie Artifact Creature Token. Alright. Well, let's just grab the Commander cards. And I'll set them there. Alright, last pack. Come on. Please. There we go. Hmm. All right. We got the swamp, Agroth, Saint of Nature, which I've already pulled a bunch of those. I think I have three foils now of it. Mishra's Foundry Extended Art, another staff of Titania. A bone saw, Mishra's bobble, unwinding clock, schematic, and a gold bug, and Liberator Urza's battle thopter. Oh, and a golem token, power stone. All right. Well, there's the back of gold bug. Got to show the back of Optimus Prime too. There we go. Yeah, well, I was hoping to get a shattered glass like. Optimus Prime or Ultra Magnus. Any Shattered Glass I didn't have. 
That would have been nice. That's the first time I pulled an unwinding clock. I'll put the, my rares in this pile. They're not supposed to go in there. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, hit that like, share, subscribe. Good luck with the openings, and I'll see you in my next video. Goodbye.